Hello and welcome to episode 7 of our Pharmacy Calculations Practice Series. And today we're going to address a question that came to us via email. So this question reads, how many ounces of medication are needed to last 8 days if the dose of medication is 1 and 1 half teaspoonfuls 4 times a day? Now a few things we're going to point out here is that they're asking you to provide ounces. So our answer needs to be total ounces required. We know that the duration of treatment is going to be eight days, and they're giving us a dose in teaspoonfuls, one and a half teaspoonfuls, four times a day. So we're going to need to be able to convert from teaspoonfuls to ounces and use this other information, you know, four times a day for eight days in our math. Now, when you're preparing for the PTCE, you need to memorize some unit conversions. And the metric system is the most important. And if you could remember how the metric system relates to other standard units, you can do a good job converting between most units. So a couple things I would have memorized for this is that one teaspoon is equal to five milliliters and one ounce is equal to 30 milliliters. So if you had memorized those two unit conversions, you can also convert between teaspoons and ounces because if one ounce is 30 milliliters and a teaspoon is five milliliters, we can deduce then that one, I'm sorry, one ounce is gonna be equivalent to 30 divided by five, which is six teaspoons. Okay, so you might not necessarily have need to memorize that, but if you had memorized the milliliter equivalents, you could figure this out. So this is going to be our conversion factor, or the ratio of teaspoons to ounces that we'll use to solve this equation. Now, the first step I would probably take is to figure out the total dose in teaspoons. And if we know that we're taking 1.5 or 1.5 teaspoons four times a day, we can multiply that by four, which tells us how many teaspoons we're taking a day. And we're going to do that for eight days. So we'll multiply that by eight. And that will give us the total dose in teaspoons for this duration of therapy. So 1.5 times 4 times 8 equals 48 teaspoons. But we're not done because the answer needs to be in ounces. And to figure out what that is in ounces, we can set up a proportion. And we're going to put what we're looking for in the numerator on the right-hand side. So we need to know how many ounces. So x ounces is equivalent to 48 teaspoonfuls. And we put our known ratio on the left-hand side, but we need to keep our units consistent. So in the numerator, we're going to put ounces. And if we go back to our known ratio here, one ounce is equal to six teaspoons full. And then to solve this using cross multiplication, you take one ounce divided by six, just like it's represented there on the left-hand side. And then you cross multiply that by 48 teaspoons full. And the answer then becomes one divided by six times 48, which is going to be eight ounces. Now, that's going to be the answer to this question. There's other quicker ways you could have solved this, to be honest with you, but I think being consistent in using these proportions helps you from making any mistakes. I mean, you could have simply taken 48 and divided that by uh, 6, um, but still, it's easier to look at it in a proportion and be consistent. If you have any questions about this or maybe you want to see a different way to solve it, feel free to reach out to us and let us know. And you can reach us on our Facebook page listed here. You can reach us via email or directly on our website at pharmacytechscholar.com.